You're tuned in to the Pete McDevitt YouTube stream. Pete's calling the game live and in real time. Join the large and active community of fans in our family-friendly chat room, hosted by some of the best moderators in the business. Whether it's America's pastime baseball, a battle on the gridiron, or an NHL hockey game, you'll find the best sports commentary on YouTube is right here at the Pete McDevitt Show. And it's all starting right now. Well, welcome in, everybody. We're getting started here tonight, Tampa Bay, Florida. A last-minute decision to do this game today, and I figure, what the heck? So, Jesse, hello. Welcome in. Bruce Harper, Mr. Fulton, Andrew, welcome in. Thank you for joining tonight. Hopefully, we'll get some, uh, get a little YouTube share out and meet some new people and all that kind of fun chicanery that goes with doing YouTube as we're... Sitting here watching a little hockey tonight. I want to retire. Watch a little hockey tonight. From Fidelity to envision a plan for the future. They are still a minute away from dropping it off to the broadcast team in the arena. Shannon's professionally managed IRA has a strategy based on and reward, which leaves Shannon feeling so good she can enjoy more of what's right in front of her. That's the planning effect. There we go. From Fidelity. Thank you, Bruce. We always appreciate that. You might realize it's time to switch things up. Always appreciate the like button. It all helps. Because when you're with Amex, it's never a question of if you'll make it happen. It's when. A little on a commercial break right now, right before they get ready to start. Still about 10 minutes out to game time. They usually start the broadcast at 7, and they drop the first puck about 7 to 10. 7 to 10 or so. They show up for their teams, for each other, and for their communities. And at every level, from Pee Wee to the pros, Enterprise shows up for them. Proud to connect hockey fans to the this game. Day, this day's gone by pretty quick. So I just switched to Verizon Business. Thank Unlimited. you, Jesse. Great data that, that you're dropping in there. Business. We switched too. Unlimited premium data, unlimited hotspot data. My point of sale is on point. You know it's from the most reliable 5G network in America. You know you Jesse, I see Paul looks like he's having a good time with down there. He looks like he's uh, got himself involved with everything. Every time I turn in a picture, somebody's doing something with Paul. That's good for him. Excited for him for that. Good for him. All right, 32 and 15 Tampa Bay Lightning on the ice tonight. We're going to do Tampa Bay twice this week. That's kind of cool. Ready to get back to work. Leading the way in points coming out of the All Star break grind for Tampa Bay, Nikita Kucherov and Steven Stamkos. Nikita Kucherov is a point producing machine. He's got 53 assists that leads the entire National Hockey League. 72 points, that's third overall. I don't think there's anybody on the team that has more pressure than Nikita Kucherov except the goaltender. Because every time he gets out there, 86 gets the puck. Everybody gets it to him. The power play, it runs through Nikita Kucherov. And he always comes through. He makes sure that he comes through. He can make plays that few others can. Steven Stamkos, it's been a terrific season for him already. I don't know if he'll get to the 100-point mark, but boy, he's got an excellent shot at it. It's because he's playing so well on the road right now, folks. He is just ripping the points off. He's got 26 points and 23 games on the road. Oh. Man, that's some good numbers there. That's some good numbers there. Alexander Barkov, an all-star MVP 
Matthew Kachuk. Yeah, Matthew Kachuk has definitely not been a disappointment. Yeah, he went away with the hardware and won some money in the All-Star game and just going along with the rest of the way this season has gone for him. Good for him that he got invited to that. That's awesome. He's a brash, in-your-face kind of guy. He's chewing on that mouth guard. That's awesome. He's willing to chew you up, and that's where he makes his living. It's always he's nice when you go down there and you're invited to things. I'm happy for him. To push you're not going to get him out of there easily. He's got some great hands and can make plays. And Sasha Markov is just plain and simply one of the best two-way forwards in the entire National Hockey League. He missed 10 games already this year, and he's still second on the team. Oh, did he? That's awesome. I've never done that myself. That's awesome. What? Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Back to the wrong one. Sorry. Uh, let me go find my hockey one. Sorry, guys. My wife's in here bothering me, asking me questions. Driving machine. Visit for exceptional offers. Our screen will change as soon as we get the uh, game. The Florida Lottery has contributed more than forty-two billion dollars. To education. And by Can't do anything till then. International Boat Show, February 15th through 19th. Visit MiamiBoatShow.com. They won't give me the screen until sunrise. right about and puck and drop or right Arena. after. Arena round three of the Sunshine State Showdown. These two teams met in this building back in October. That night it went to overtime at Great Point and the overtime winner. Then later in December it was round number two. Family Arena, the lighting with three goals in the third to pull away. We'll see what we get tonight in round three. Round three, I like it. Two good teams, too. What's up, Einstein? My network has gone kaput. Uh, we tried to say uh, the Verizon commercial. Oh, of course. Nah, you're still a genius, but there is a smarter way to say it. Oh. Switch to Verizon. For a limited time, get Welcome Unlimited for just $25 a line. $25? This, yeah, this one is the one that drives me nuts. Well, you would know. I'm switching. Now is the best time to switch to Verizon for just $25 a line, guaranteed for three years. That's up to seven. Whoops. Back, go back, go yeah, back. Teaching 16, 17 year olds, and so I grew out this beard for the first time so that I would appear many years older than I actually was. Is that the secret to classroom management? Is a nice beard? You know, I no, asked them at I the end of the year how old they thought I was. I don't want that. 30, 35, so. Man, I can see it's going to be one of those nights. I always love it. One of those nights tonight. Hulu dropped off on me. My wife knows I'm live watching, doing the game. She's up here yelling questions about a bathroom. Oh, 
Come on in. Come on back in. There we go. All set to go here at FLA Live Arena with a nice break for a lot of players, but not all. Matthew Kachuk in his first season as a Panther represented the home team right here on All-Star Weekend. He was named MVP, and there is Nikita Kucherov. He's got 72 points in the season. He also spent the weekend here. The goaltenders tonight, another guy who played on All-Star Weekend, Andre Vasilevsky. He'll get the start again. He's won 10 of his last 13, and at the other end... He's been good this year. He has not played in two and a half weeks. He's been out with injury, but he's jumping back into it. Pavrosky back in for Very Florida. Well. Good evening, everybody. This is Dave Brander alongside Brian Engblom, and we are all ready to go. This guy is for sure going to be ready to go. Matthew Kachuk has had an excellent season here in Florida, Brian. Yeah, Kachuk uh, has been everything as advertised. He had a great first half of the season. All right, they're getting ready to drop the puck, so let me see if I can get the screen here. Did not make the skates this morning. His coach, Paul Murray, said he's just busy out driving a new car around. <laughs> and all the family that he has in town at his house. Oh, so give us a go. game. Round three of the Battle of Florida. Victor Hedman handles the puck as he takes the pad, throws it up the middle where it's intercepted and sent back by the Panthers. And that is going to be icing right off the bat against Florida. Well, the Lightning have beaten Florida the last two times. The first few times they've seen them this year. And going back to last year, they've beaten them four of the last five. Well, does history mean anything? Nope, not right at the moment. John Cooper knows that. He and his team have played fewer games than most teams in the National Hockey League. They're actually four and five games. Come on, guys. Give us Some a screen. Teams, like Toronto in front of them has played four more games. So where do the Lightning really sit the standings? Who? We'll see when they catch those games up. Carter for Hagee took that puck all the way down the ice, sends it around the boards for Hagee, the former member of the Lightning, in their leading goal score. There we go. Okay. Kucherov goes wide with a puck to Braden Boyd. Now he's got to get up on the screen. Back, drops out to Kucherov. One touch pass into the middle, and it was broken up by Ver Hagee. This now Forsley gets it to center, and he will dump it in. Knocked into the corner, Anton Rondell. He is bumped off the puck there by Sergeyev. Boy back there trying to get it away from Sam Reinhardt. Reinhardt was the guy who scored the overtime winner in their last game, January 28th, the same Saturday night that the Lightning last played nine days ago. In the two games these two teams have played, the Lightning spent more time in the offensive zone than Florida has. Florida gets more chances on the rush. Come on. That again. He loves to put the puck to the net. Here's their captain, Barkov. He ran into a crowd there. The corner on the side board. Sure, I think he's the puck. And now it's Alex Colon into the middle for Hagel. Hagel with a jump, steps into the line. Nice little move there by Paul. And his pass ends up with Florida. Why am I not getting what Hagel, I need? The lead leader in takeaways could not take that one away from Barkov as he works it down the ice. And it's another icing call against the Panthers. A couple of things that have worked really well for the Lightning against these Florida Panthers. One is All right, that's going to have to be it, I guess. They really had trouble trying to stop power, the power play of the Tampa Bay Lightning. Uh, and the other one is the big line. Stamkos, Kucherov, and Point have absolutely killed Florida. And that goes back to last year. Braden Point has got 14 goals in 17 games just against All right, here we go. And you'll be looking for more of the Brophy's. Makes that save on the shot. From the we got full strength here, 18 11 on the clock. January 19th at Montreal. He only played two minutes. Tampa Bay and Florida tonight, everybody. Even face a shot that night. Spencer Knight, who was their regular number two, he was hurt as well. So they were without their number one and two goaltenders for about two weeks. Yeah, Paul Maurice talked very positively. I almost want to. We went 8 4 and 2, and we had locked both our goaltenders. If I zoom oh, into this twice. I want to see something real quick here. I'll take the set off for a second. I want to see how much I can zoom into this. Stripped there by Cousins, held into the line by Perbitz, who knocks it right back in. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 
Paul Maurice talked very positively this morning. He said, you know what? We're playing a lot harder. Our record doesn't show great things, that's for sure. The Can I go one level up? Really good start to the season. Then we missed some key players like Barkov. Barkov missed 10 games this year. Then the January schedule just killed us. We didn't play that bad, but we were I go to that so big. Much. So they're really looking up. Eight, four, Can I not get the scoreboard on it? And we lost both of our goaltenders. I talked to Barkoff and Gudis this morning as well. That gets the scoreboard on it. That's bigger on the screen, yes? They've got a lot of ground to make up. For everybody. Jesse, is that better with it bigger like that on the screen? In the area, as was Domestikov. Domestikov now with the puck playing in his 600th career game. That shot towards the net deflected just wide. Bill is that be, yeah it's a lot better all right then i've got to get it to that then this is going to be a work in motion stream so jesse just let people know that we're doing a work in motion stream tonight because i've got to take a screenshot of this and go fix it on the other screen what happens in this first period should certainly mean a lot if, if we're going to make it work. A lot of mistakes, well, the first period Screenshot, capture. It. it does look a lot better when you can see a lot more of it and see the screen. Florida on the attack. Oh! Trying to get it back to the line, picked up by Cooper. Where's my NHL sets? Even Stamkos coming in with an 11-game point streak. It's second point streak by this season of double digits. And I love the way Stamkos playing on the road. That's the really impressive thing. He always plays right, well. So that's the, the one I was just using. All season long on the road. 26 Let points and keep that and make it on the road. Outstanding stuff from Stamkos. Time Lundell. Shot backhand pass. Loops it up the ice. Nick Paul trying to get it out. Can't get it around Barkov. Centers it out for Lundell. It's shot. Oh! That's redo this. Good chance there for the Panthers. Reinhardt. Gets it back to the D and it's controlled by Mark Stahl. I get the screenshot to come over. They're good on the rush against the Lightning. They're good on the rush in general. So we've seen their two best chances already for Florida is getting in and getting chances at the net right away. Little tip play to Bogosian up to center. Duda steps up, breaks that up, and fires it back in for Florida. All right, that's uh, kind of centered on there. Hedman leads it in the corner for Belmar. Belmar has scored in his last game a win against the LA Kings back on January 28th. Move this over so I can see chat. Hey, Victor, what's up? I'm rebuilding my screen right now. Oh! That was really close. All right. Another nice save. Brandon Montour, their top scoring defenseman this season. He's got a hard shot. 
as a Rister knocked down. Jim Pat Montour at point steps away with Stankos. Stankos hands it around, trying to feed it back inside to point, and no shot. Lovell gets it back to Reinhardt, who flips it back to Gustav Forsley, who is also on pace for career highs. He's been a real nice addition, a guy they had picked up on waivers a few years ago. Out of there. there. Sam Bennett, into the line with Matthew Kachuk. Kachuk stepping in, his shot stopped by Vasilevsky as he was eyeball to eyeball with the leading score for the Florida Panthers. Good start to this one. All right, so. Take the comments off the screen. Take this off the screen. Take that off the screen. I can move this when we get the new screen over here. So let me send this over first. Not so smart. Nah, you're still genius, but there is a smarter way to say it. Switch to Verizon and get a new iPhone 14 Pro and Apple Watch on them. Share. Yeah, right now, get iPhone 14 download. Pro and Apple Watch SE on us. Number That's nine. Up to $1,200. Eureka! I'm How many times are we going to get this Verizon commercial tonight? The network you deserve, the savings it's ridiculous. I'm rebuilding my screen for anybody that's coming in. Jesse's letting people know in the chat. Hey, Jeff. If you want to reach the ring, the all new CRV and CRV. Come on, go over. Airdrop. MacBook Pro. All right. Screen's going to glitch for a second while I send this up here. Take that off there real quick. All right, here comes the screen. My first test one. Olive Garden's never-ending first course is always on us. All right, so it would look like that Garden for, salad, for general on purposes first. On us. That's kind of a good standby for how it would look. I need to tighten up the right side a little bit. Out there. This is a big game for him. He's come Perhaps over just a hair. Games okay, so we got that set up there the for what we want and by all the way around. So, so now I need to put in my camera and it all even gets a little poke for where I'm going to put that. Do, do, do. Into the middle of the ice. Bass is going to stop that all day long. But he's going to drive to the net. Kachuk is third in the National Hockey League in getting into that area right in the in the hash marks, right in that inner slot. Third in shots on goal there. Great I guess I'll go second. like right Either here. One of these teams is shy of getting right in the goaltender's face. He's led by Kachuk and by Braden Point on each team. There's a goal, Florida. It's going to be on the board in a second. I saw it on the screen first. Right there, coming up. Gonna have a goal by Florida. Looks like we're a couple seconds behind. There it is. Florida up one nothing. All right, so we got the scoreboard on there. So what am I missing? Now? But this is a real smart play. Need our logo. Where do I right want to put that? I think I want to put that. Chernak never saw him. He's trying to make a nice little play. I think it was the great point. Right here. Watch this again. Boom. There it comes from the blind spot. Now you've got everybody scrambling. On top of that, he makes a nice saucer pass. Like that. Hey, Lila Rose. For him, he's got that knack about him. He just is calm. He waits in the right areas. He is scoring goals Let's like crazy. Guy worked this. himself up from the East Coast League and the American Leagues early on in his career. Verhage has been outstanding for Florida. 27 goals on the season for Verhage is already a career high. Kachuk extends his point streak to seven games and it's one nothing for the home team. These two up here. Center. Flips it back to Kalorn. Kalorn goes rink wide over to Bogosian, and he will dump that puck in. Hagel, first to the puck, centers it over in front. There's Kalorn taking a swing, and he couldn't find that puck. It was bouncing on him, and it's cleared by the Panthers. Headed back to get it. 
There's that. Sub count. Copy. Drop that over here. Copy this. Lead down there by Nick Pervix. And the puck comes loose for a point. Point in the middle for Kucherov. Kucherov dancing it, gets it back to point, back to Kucherov, little touch. And he goes into the corner for Sergeyev. Back of the point, Pervix. Keep it up for Stanko for the shot. And a kick saved by Bobrovsky. Copy that. Backing it up is Sergeyev across to Pervix. And the Bolts work it back inside the line. Settled by Ekblad. That looks good Four right there. Up ahead to All right, does. let's see here. Barkov did not get a stick on that, so it is a nice and call against the Panthers. And here with the new teeth now, player profile. Subscriber count. Well, let's go back to Carter Copy. Ray, of course, the former Tampa Bay Lightning. They didn't want to lose him, but, hey, you know, it's always about salary cap. He's done a terrific job since he's been here. Year by year, look at the games and the goals, how they got up and up and up. He's just efficient. He's no nonsense. He's no maintenance. The man he can score. Eight goals in his last nine games. The only goal in the game so far is Pat Maroon in the corner. Got nice get shot. Away from Works near side. Here is Ross Belmar is there. Now it's Ross Colton. He'll feed the line for Chernak. Maroon now in the high See that across the top. Step. And back to Chirac. Quick one time. And tipped on the way through it. Kind of a knuckleballer that Bobrovsky had to kick out. And now here comes Barkov. Down low. Little walk up move. And that's what she came across. Uh -huh. Made a big stop. One of the doorstep on Reinhardt. Slick little move. Good hands in tight. And Vasilevsky shut the door. Lifted down by Chernak. And that is going to be icing against the Bolts. Yeah, a little rust turn. Ah, don't lose that That's signal. Prevented by Basel. Otherwise, it's another goal for Florida. The turnover there, Chernak was involved, and it's a really nice pass. All right, so right I got this so far. Right through the top of the crease, but Basel, just patient, patient. You know, great legs. He had everything covered anyway. Reinhardt couldn't fish the puck out from between his feet. The Lightning win this face-off. Ah, excuse me. He's going to take the face-off, but here we have the first sign of a little... Got a little pushy and shoving going on. That'll be good for Eric Chernak. There was always so that with these disease speed, but right now it is one nothing of Florida on Valley Sports. Remember the old school cheat codes? Ridiculous moves that no one could pull off in real life until now. Now there is that guy with the unfair speed. Okay, so scores, we got that. We're going to put the, uh, the comments across the bottom. Let's see what else I'm missing. For me, they were just ahead of their time. Uh, blue shields. I want to use them. This electric feels different. Kind of like this one. It's powered by the most potent source of energy. All right, let me send this over so we can take a look at it. Share, download. This is the Lexus number nine. Electrification. Inspired by creative. Transparent background. Download. I'll send this one over. This way we can. Get a good look at it. So, I just switched to Verizon Business Unlimited. It is just right for my little business. We switched too. Unlimited premium data, unlimited hotspot data. My point of sale is on point. We know it's from the most reliable 5G What's it say? Test stream is what, what I'm looking for. At no extra cost. When it comes to your business, not all bars are created equal. So, switch to Verizon, the most reliable 5G network in America, and get the unlimited plan that your business there it comes. deserves on the network America relies on. One 
to hear uh, in Sunrise and hear a Duncan Huel performance. Great point went to the Bahamas during the All Star break. He never been to the All right, so we're starting to get something going here. Let's get the names back up there first. He just puts them away all the time, and he has owned Sergei Bobrovsky. 14 goals in 17 games that he played against Bobrovsky. Yeah, that's owning a goaltender, all right. I, I asked him about it this morning. He said, no, I didn't really know it. I, I read it this morning. Just kind of shrugged his shoulders. Now let's get Jeff back over there. He's got 29 goals right now. His next goal will be the 30th. Third time is in the 30 goal mark. And counting this season. He's been hot. Across to Edmund. Goes outside the blue line and he will dump that one in. Picked up by Mark Stahl. The veteran snaps that one around. Cousins goes back the other way and it's going to be picked up by Stahl. Dumped all the way down the ice. Past the midway point of the first period for Hagee. All right, there we go. We got them both over there. So this is a start. I kind of like how that guy's kind of leaning on the picture thing right there. Kind of like that, actually. Oh, hold on, let me fix that. I mean, they were leaving everybody in their rear view mirror, but they got to the playoffs, and that's more like NASCAR. So they bring in a guy like Matthew. Kajun, so kind of like that. Like Go look at. Let me lock in the picture. And then they also changed the driver behind the wheel, Paul Marie. So they've had to what make a lot of changes, and they are. That's they an are old one. And tougher, and you can see that they still have the okay, they so still we got that set up, up so far. But are they too far back to make the playoffs? Get the it's numbers up here. Story, but they certainly have not given up. But they're going to run out of racetrack pretty quick if they don't start winning on a regular basis. Florida head coach Paul Murray. Where are the numbers? Did they all go away? He feels his team is trending in the right direction and playing harder. Yeah. They're harder to play against. Yeah, that, that, that's what I mean. They're, they're, they're more all right, there's my numbers, my total numbers. I mean, they were scoring goals just at a crazy pace last year. But in the playoffs, it's different. It's different. We all know that. And he even alluded to the fact, he said, look at the lightning goal back four or five years ago. How skilled Put that down the bottom there. They had to go through. And he's Let me get chat right. back up here and see what I want to do with chat. Stat on how high scoring they were. They were well over four goals a game. The highest scoring team in the NHL since the 95-96 Pittsburgh Penguins. That had a couple of stars on that team. They were winning games down by three and four goals and coming from behind. That, that's really hard to sustain, and it doesn't happen in the playoffs. And they found that out. Here's that glad puts this one towards the net. Lightning meantime. Got to get back into this one. Down a goal. There's a shot by Forsling, and that is sucked by Van Gillespie. Here comes Kudrov. Kudrov trying to cut inside of Forsling. Couldn't do it. AT and T, leave me alone. Here comes Markov. Okay. Inside B for Anton Lundell turned over. Little flip pass up ahead by Maroon, picked up by Colton. I mean, I could make that smaller and put it in there, but I don't kind of like that. He's up to ten double digits again for him. Let me look at the bottom here. Goes into the corner hard against Stall, and it comes free for Maroon. He'll look back to the line. Here's the goal with a shot, tipped in front, good save by Bobrovsky. He was able to see that. Ah, uh, come on, shot. signal. Stick in there. That allowed Bobrovsky to see that shot from the point. So things are starting to heat up now. Those battles in the corner, the net front presence where guys are fighting for position. These two teams love to go at it, but coming out of the All-Star break, you got to get heated up again. The engine's starting to get there. Dump it attempt, but screaming over the glass there, straight into the I seat. could do it like that. Bobrovsky been out since January the 9th, but getting himself back in, looking, he had to fight for it, too. There's the box that I was talking so about. So it's got the that up top net, there. The net kind of got tipped over. That way it leaves the bottom completely open to for our uh, comments. Yeah, it's been a while since Bob back in, so it may take a while to get his feel back. But he said, you know what? Okay. It's a good time. Everybody in the league is basically coming off a one-week break, so goaltenders are rusty all around the league in a lot of ways. And that gets a good portion of that there. They're having trouble with the signal right now on Hulu. Signal's going in and out here. It's a good time. Everybody in the 
All right, so we got that. Jesse says it looks good. So let me go back over here. Okay, so what happened to my numbers? Where did they go? Did we delete all of them? Uh, what is our subscriber count here? 881, I think, was the last I saw. This is the Lexus variety of electrification, inspired by Green Floor and powered by you. So I just switched to Verizon Business Unlimited. It is just ready for my. I mean, that in, in white, it looks channel. okay. Unlimited premium data, unlimited hotspot data, live line of sale is on point. You know, it's Where's the most reliable widget? 5G network in America. You know, you can get up to 10 times the speed at no extra cost. When it comes to your business, not all bars are created equal. So switch to Verizon, the There's most reliable widget. 5G network in America, and get the unlimited plan that your business deserves on the network America relies on. We just locked. There, there we go. Hey, Gene, what's up? All right, so what do I still want to get in here? I want to get... Get a great deal on your own peanut butter box, plus great prices on quality pet meds. Just order online. We'll contact your vet for prescription approvals, then ship free to your door. Sounds like we're getting peanut butter. Is that there? Okay, yeah, we're getting there a little bit, Jesse. Getting there. That's a little bit easier to see with that. This should have been a penalty. Watch the forearm shiver here. Vladdy's going down. He, he kind of catches his foot. His, the stick is right there. But it's that forearm shiver coming right across. Nemestikov couldn't really move. I mean, he, he basically was stationary. The play was going on. Gudis gave him a push to get him over towards the board because he wasn't even taking a step out there. That is that actually shot. I saw Pat what came down even with the, the top uh, of the TV timeout. And top of the point there. The They're always in flex. Points and that? between these two teams, and we've got one right here. We'll see how things get heated up now. Held in by Barkov. Here's Reinhardt with a shot, and that one ricochets wide to the line and out and all the way down the ice. That's too many times now, especially against the Barkov line. Barkov's positioning is always stellar. Another turnover kept in by him turned to a scoring chance for Reinhardt again. Reinhardt, 33 goals last season, knocking on the door of 20 already. Here's Barkov, his shot, and a save by Vasilevsky. On a tricky, hard wrister from Alexander Barkov. Yeah, I'll say, man, he got something on that. But again, this is the rush. And they see are something here. The lightning. Look at the gap between the lightning forwards and the lightning deep. So the lightning deep have got to back off. A little bit of crisscrossing and then a drop pass. Now so you have more room for the... Strengths, intermissions, and what? Not there is covering anything. Okay, I see what I, I want to. I want to take that down. To gather up some momentum, he ripped that one into a tough spot for Vasky to save. Arkov on an 11 game point streak, just like Stankos entering this game tonight. For Hagee back to the line. Sit back in by the Panthers. Kachuk is up there against Cole, and it comes free for the Lightning. It's next to the, the W. That's got to stop right there. Stall. So I do have room in the corner for one. Hockey. Right in front. Now Stahl again. It's the shot. Knocked down. Blocked aside by 
All right, let me send this one over. Yeah, that's true. Download number nine. Number nine. All right, let me send this over and try to clean it up again one more time. Oh, nice stop. Come on. And he knew that Colton was on a fly pattern coming off that wall into the middle of the ice. There's the broken stick. He had one eye on it. And he was able to control it, gives it right to Ross Colton. So the lightning gets something going. Maybe that'll back Florida off a little bit. But Bobrovsky certainly has looked very sharp and very aggressive. Stan Colts with a face off win. They got a shot away. Stan Colts wins it off the post. Everybody in the building heard that one. Okay. What? Are you going to hit? When are we eating dinner? Do what? Yeah. Yes. Good job. Proud of you. All right, getting close. Getting close. So that's getting good there. Try this again. Not great. His win and loss percentage is not great at all. Is he going to get back to being that nine, ten million dollar guy that he had a pretty good year last year? Is he going to get back there again? And it'll be a big factor to make the playoffs. Killorn, back to line. Chernak shot is blocked by Pitt. It comes right back to Chernak. His drive. Off the mark. And cleared down the ice by Kachuk. That's more clean. Gets that one to Barkov. And now Hagel picks up the puck. Cleared out by the Bolts down the ice. It's been a nightmarish first period. I'm thinking we got it. Combination. Whatever happens inside the zone, even when they get the puck, they're not There's nothing that I'm missing there that I can see. Chances consistently. Players battle for the puck there in the corner. Bill Mars takes it out. Got it to Ross Colton who had that great chance moments ago. Corey and people can definitely see it a lot better, right? Scores bigger on the board. The uh, times bigger on the board. One minute left in a period. Now the screen will always be a little bit ahead of us. There's nothing I can do about that. Under a minute. Under a minute. Eric Stahl comes in right back in. 
Now we just got to get YouTube to share us out, get more people over here. Turned over there to Tierney, took him out of bounds, but he bolts two workers on the ice and out. Forsling across to Ekblad, pumps the puck in there, rattles around the glass. It Cousins is battling for it along with Chris Tierney. I don't think we're at a penalty. We're not at a penalty. Yeah, I think we're good now. One above gaming. What's up? Stamkos, that's a great name. One above gaming. You do a lot of gaming on your channel, my man? Matching minors here. Matching minors currently. That's going to be the end of the first period there. Stamkos' goal will have to be in the second period. It'll have to be in the second. I was just a little pushing and pushing and hugging of each other here. Looked like they were just dancing is what they were doing. Used to a lot of gaming, but I got in band. I appreciate you. Hopefully you like what you're doing, like what we're doing here. Hit a subscribe if you haven't already, buddy. You're always welcome here. They're just finishing the last couple seconds. The TV is a little bit behind the actual game. So that is the end of the first right here. Thanks for subscribing. One above. We'll get your name up on the big board here. There we go. You're up on the big board. We thank you. Well, it took a little bit to get it cleared up and get the uh, screen cleared up. Trying to make it a little bit bigger for everybody to watch that's watching on their computer or whatever. So, I think we got it. I think we got it. Now we just got to wait for the second period to start so I can... Actually, watch some hockey with you guys. We're doing Tampa Bay twice this week. I'm doing them on uh, Friday or Saturday. Coming up as well. Just happened that they were the times and quality games that they were to watch. So, if you're a Tampa Bay fan, we'll be calling those guys twice this week. Next big hmm. idea. Say, spot Simple and easy tonight with hockey. Hockey's so easy to just sit and watch because you don't have a lot of buttons I got to try to whack. No. Well, you know, this is my second channel, one above. I have another channel that has uh, almost 16,000 followers where we do football and baseball. And I moved basketball, hockey, soccer, and NASCAR over to the second channel here. So um, just because it was getting too much on one channel, screwing up the algorithm. But thank you. Keeps me, uh, gives me something to do each day. Rather than just uh, sit around and do nothing. At least I can sit around and talk to people. Makes me feel like I'm leaving my home more. Which is good. Always like to do that. Now get you through all these crazy commercials. And the intermission. 20 minute intermission. And we'll be ready to rock up here on the period two in a one nothing game with the Panthers on top. Both these teams will be there in the playoffs. You know, we know that. Both these teams are going to be there in the playoffs. 
which aren't that far away. We're starting the second half. Uh, you can reach out to me via email. I'll be glad to, to look at it and see if it's available or not. You know, I have to look at conflicts with other things and everything. But, yeah, you're more than welcome to send me an email. Uh, Jesse, if you want to put my email into the into the chat, you're more than welcome. I hate it when these games are on the the Hulu because there's no commercials. Weird, weird way of broadcasting. Panther Land. A lot of those Floridians will love Panther Land. Thank you, Jesse. He's underwater, less than 500, but look what he's done in the first period. He stopped all 10 by Tampa Bay. Uh, some quality chances by the Lightning, not necessarily um, yeah. off the turnovers. I think it was some good play by the Lightning, but the Roski is sharp in that period, which he's probably going to have to be down the stretch here if the Panthers are going to get themselves in the playoff picture. Uh, to the highlights, Carter Berhage with the... First uh, intermission here. Having a career year we got one goal on the board. What we need is a good fight so I can get a short out of it. Put up the short. That's what we need. Good fight tonight. I think Vasilevsky gets over there in time, but he still gets a shot away. As you can see, it hits Vasilevsky's glove there. Here's Tampa Bay with an opportunity to lead in this first period. Nice step by Mutt. It got a little chippy here at the end of this first period, which I did like. I was happy with that. Perfect tip. Vasilevsky's trying to gain his control at the net, gets pushed off, and he makes a pretty quality save right there. Lightning near the end of the period have a couple of good chances. That Stamford first. I need to change that. Right off the face off. And what a play by Cooch. Finding Stammer right in the slot and goes right off the post. As presented by Advent Health, our first period scoring summary for Hagee is 27. And that comes 27th goal for Hagee to chuck his 42nd assist. Of the year for the All-Star game. Phillies, Eagles, and wild card Flyers to make a run. Hey, it's great, great for them, you know. I'm going to call a lot of Phillies games over on the, the primary channel this year, and I'm going to be calling the Super Bowl, of course, you know. It's good, good time to be living in the Philadelphia area or be from Philadelphia or just be a fan of that area. It's a great time to do that right now. Kind of like Tampa was a couple of years ago when they were winning all their stuff. They're going to be playing four-on-four as well. Second period for about a minute and 43 seconds. Yeah, it is going to be four on four for a minute 43 when we start back up. Wide open hockey. In the back of the, you know, between the shoulder blades, but his stick actually hits Vlad's skate and he goes down. I thought maybe it was a little bit of an ankle injury here, uh, but when he gets to the, the sign is when he gets to the bench, he seems to be okay walking off. So maybe it's a little. Uh, it was a shot to the back of the head. That's what that was. He, he looked loaded there. I, I wonder if Toronto, that's worth a phone call with the second look for Renko Gudis. Two of the uh, nine hits in the first period registered by the Panthers, who lead one nothing as Tampa Bay tries to beat Florida for a third time this season. That's good stuff to do, to beat a team three times in one year. You know, I mean, you know, three go undefeated against the team. It is not easy to do. That's really tough. That's what I need right there. So you think you can help? I can try. Hey, what you doing? Ah, just cleaning up a trash can. Wow. It's important to build trust. See if we put your address and phone number on here. Well, you can never be too safe. With trash? Progressive can't protect you from becoming your parents, but we can protect your home and auto when you bundle with us. Don't look at the head, you're gonna mess. Always looking at the head. Like Kyrie Trade is man, has me thinking about Jason Robertson for a goal tonight. 
Well, they're trying to do something in Dallas. I thought about I I I, I was looking at the Mavericks to call their game. But I, what am I doing this week? I just put my games together earlier this evening. Uh, I'm doing Dallas at hockey against Tampa Bay on the 11th. I'm doing New York and Philadelphia in basketball. Yeah, I got to add in. I'll have to look at next week and do a Dallas game in basketball because I'm doing two college games this week. Tennessee, Vanderbilt, and TCU and Baylor. So they should be some good games. Should be some good games. Yeah, Maybe adjust that college thing. Walden University. Yeah, that'll be interesting over there. See what they do. Did you download Grammarly? If you want to ace the season, then don't press submit. Grammarly helps you clean up your messy, confusing sentences to get your point across clearly. Sorry, I'm late. Did you know that Grammarly checks against billions of sites and catches any accidental plagiarism? Looks like an A-plus to me. Looks like we got... This. I've been seeing this place promoting like crazy, this Grammarly place. They should reach out to me and sponsor my channel. Interesting. That would be good. Let me bring in my expo. Jesse, how's my weather looking for Disney when I go down? Hopefully it's looking good. It's a rich history. If it's not, we're gonna have to cancel this cancel the trip. It's worth a brand new Samsung Galaxy S23. Wait, really? What about this? AT and T deal is back. Pre order a free Samsung Galaxy S23 with a Galaxy phone ready and care and condition. Better help takes the stigma. Oh come on with these commercials. There's so many people who still have that. I still think there'll be a couple more big trades in the NBA before the year's out. Before the trade deadline's out. For help, sometimes it feels like something you should be ashamed of, or you should want others to know. Better help is <laughs> They just cut that commercial off. They realize, hey, we're running too many doggone commercials. I'm cutting it off. It looks like Miami, Florida. The strip down in Miami, Florida, right there. South Florida, that is it. Which hosted All Star Festivities, one nothing Florida Lightning fans. The United by Hockey Mobile Museum is coming to Tampa. Make sure to check out the Mobile Museum this Thursday from two to eight. Uh, prior and in conjunction with the Bolts game that evening against Colorado, the NHL Black Hockey History Tour aims to. Gotta love these All Florida matchups, and both team both teams are solid. Players, as well as its current Black Stars. For more information, visit NHL.com/slash Black. History. Welcome to our rooms to go lounge. Underway through 20 minutes of action. The push now to 33 games to go, including this one for Tampa Bay to head toward the postseason. And Florida with a lot of pressure. Well, these guys are sitting up like it's in their living room. Yeah, it sure is. I mean, they're playing pretty well tonight. I mean, Bob Rossi has made some good saves, but it's going to be a, an uphill battle for the Panthers. They're going to have to turn things around. Did a wonderful gotcha. Hopefully it's decent down there. Stars, uh, over the past Anybody new in here for the first time we haven't said hello to, please say hello in the chat. We'd love to welcome you in. Just met uh, our new friend, One Above Gaming. Love to meet you as well. Take the million dollars. Matthew Kachuk stole the show this weekend. Obviously, the Florida Panther had seven points on the weekend. Got a hat trick in that last game. Him and Sasha Barkov represented by the Florida Panthers. As you can see, he slips in a wraparound here on Cerro's. Good time by Well, all that's good. Really fun event. It's better than here. As of right now, we're still going. Uh, Wonderful performance from all four. We shall see. Here was Andre Vasilevsky gathering autographs as well in the Atlantic yeah. Division uh, locker room. 
Waiting for intermission to cut through, everybody. Lots of events on the beach this weekend. Florida did a good job. In his Hall of Fame career, he was an All-Star. This is an anniversary date as well. The 6th day of February, 30 years ago uh, tonight, Brian Bradley represented the Tampa Bay Lightning as their very first All-Star, skating on a line with Wayne Gretzky and Brad Hall. 30 years ago, was 30 years ago. wow. That made the buck. It's a wonderful memory for him. That game played in the Forum, the old Forum in Montreal. Four on four hockey as we begin the second period and Tampa Bay trailing by a goal. Just ahead, Dave Randolph along with Brian Engelman, our second period of action from South Florida. The NHL's two sunshine state rivals head to head tonight on Battle Kids are so expensive, Dad. Now Katie needs braces. Maybe try switching your car trash to progressive. You can save hundreds. I don't know, Dad. And another commercial set. Maybe try switching your car insurance to Progressive. You could save hundreds. It's a great idea, TV Dad, but I said the exact same thing. Someday when you're a father, you'll understand. <laughs> and his father is not a competition. Listen to your TV Dad. Drivers who switch and save with Progressive save nearly seven hundred. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's a dumb commercial too. This is Dr. Arnold T. Petsworth. He's the owner of Petsworth Bet World. Business was steady, but then an influx of new four-legged friends changed everything. Dr. Petsworth welcomed these new patients. The only problem, more appointments, and then he needed more space. That's when Dr. Petsworth turned to his American Express business card, which offers spending potential that's built for his changing business needs. He used his card to furnish a new exam room, and everyone was happy. Get the card built for business by American Express. So I just got my HelloFresh delivery for the week. Thanks mm. Hope you guys are having a good day today. Appreciate you coming in and hanging out with us. We are just uh, in between periods, waiting for the uh, second one to start. Oh, that's good. That can change on a dime, of course. We all know that. can change on a dime. We are 18 subscribers away from 900. I'm pretty excited about that. So whatever is most compelling That's an interesting point. Is really what's going to help them open up more at the end of the day. One above with some interesting I points. Really do believe in the best of them. And I do really believe that people are stronger sometimes than they think they are in themselves. Drive time has a big announcement. What's interesting to me is with sports, all sports. It's slower during the year, but the minute you get to playoff time, the amount of people coming in and everything just goes through the roof. Like, I'm expecting Sunday with the Super Bowl to be really packed. I'm hoping it will be. And with hockey, they, we don't, usually don't get to share out until late in the game, which is also wild. When the time is right, you too will continue your legacy. Earning that for diamonds to treasure that will forever. Ooh, we're firing up the Chewy app. Can't say no to these prices. Hmm, company litter resounding yes. Salmon pate, love that for me. Essentials, check. All I hear is my Ooh, daughter in the kitchen giving my dog a hard time. Looks like we're getting close here. Lightning Hockey is presented by BMW. South Florida is where we are at tonight. It's a close one, one nothing for the Florida Panthers through 20 minutes of play. Dave Rando back with you. Alongside Brian Englund, who has 10 meetings between these two teams in this building by the time. We knew this was going to be close, and it is. What you think and what you see in the first period? I thought there was a run uh. for the Lightning uh, in the gap control and in defending in their own zone. The shots ended up 15 to 10 in favor of Florida. 
15 to 10 in favor of Florida. All right, here we go. Seconds kicking off, and we're going to start it off with four on four hockey for a few minutes. That was a heck of a shot right there in the back head. We still got four and four for 40 seconds. Not happy about that, it's Cooper. Lila's happy about it. Alright, now we're going full straight. Saw that one. He had his glove up. I think that was natural instinct, Dave. 
it went up and over the net, but Bobrovsky was still looking forward and the puck hit the glass and he reacted to the sound over his left shoulder after the fact. So Lightning got to get their momentum going, get their puck possession game going. Turn over the neutral zone, good start there. Here's where the shot's going to come. And see, Bobrovsky, the, the okay, where'd that one go? They snapped the back of the net. Face off deep inside the Florida blue line. Sam Coast has been excellent on draw for six or seven weeks. Now. All right, here we go. Tampa Bay's got to try to get back in this. And they going to look like they're going to get on there. On the screen, it's already showing. 2-1. We're about to have a Tampa Bay goal. We're about to have a Tampa Bay goal here in one minute. Our screen is a little bit ahead of our television, especially when we're broadcasting off of Hulu. Nothing I can do about it. Who's going to get it for Tampa Bay here? On the wing, way out top. Kucherov! Puts the biscuit in the basket. <laughs> Two to one game now. But what he's really good at too is shooting at unsuspecting times. And this is one. He's right up near the blue line. He'd all be taking a look, which he already does. And it's the traffic, the motion. Two to one game here. Action picking up in the second period. He just doesn't expect it to come from there. And it fools him on the short side. When Kucherov shoots, it's usually on the corner. That's a big goal for the Lightning. They needed to get something rolling here. Right back. After Bennett had made it 2 0, they get a quick response with a 16.50. Still locked in the second period. We got business is picking up. Around the back side. And it's snapped around by the veteran of Edmund Stahl. Waiting for it is Hagel. Hagel pulls it back to Tierney. Back to Bogosian. His drive hit his own man. That was Sorelli who felt that one. You like it for two goals or court. two points. Interesting. I mean, he's been pretty solid all year long. You, the guy's special. Oh, they missed an opportunity there. Florida did right, right dead center, coming down the crease. The crowd's awful quiet for all this excitement that's going on. Good job, Jesse. Backhander. No, nice save. Nice save. Got a little pushing and going on on Maroon right now. Down the ice. Cole racing back to get it. 
It put away to Nick Paul, who moves it up the ice quickly. Here's Maroon through center, and Maroon takes the puck wide, and it rolls into the corner for Cousins. Cousins up ahead towards Brandon Montour. Paul snaps that one over the opposite side of the rink, and it's scooped up there by Stahl. Waiting for it now is head to Luke Dorinan. Here comes Florida on the attack. Step back oh, nice there. shot save. Saved by that, Zelensky. Put back to the point. Stall across to Montour. Over to the Montour. wing, down to the fort. By Maroon. Comes in there. Lomberg sets it back up. Montour is going to step up a little bit. Brandon and Montour. All the way around. Montour. Cole hangs on to it. He's up for four. Oh, big blast. Ron Burke's aware because it's his rink that that yellow pit play along the bottom of the boards is really active here. That puck came whistling right back off the end wall. These right pucks are moving. I would not want to get hit with a hockey puck. A shot, Another save, Vasilevsky. Another save, Vasilevsky. We got a delayed penalty. Two minutes here, about to go on the power play. Wow. Nikita Kudrov has scored here. First it was Bennett to make it 2-0. And then one minute and 20 seconds later, Kudrov makes it 2-1 for a power play. Thanks. Power play coming up. Enterprise is ready I don't know. I think we've made some nice changes here tonight. I think it's more vi the, the ice is more visible for everybody, which is what I wanted everybody to be able to see. It's clean. Hopefully others will come in and think the same thing. God, I used to love that hockey game, Genesis. Sega Genesis Hockey was my favorite. Hey, Robert Kitchens, welcome in. The guy who scores just about every time in that one spot. And the guy who's basically a real-life glitch. So were those games really bad? I'd love to play Sega Genesis Hockey again. They were just ahead of their time. What's the next adventure? That's the real question. With Fidelity Income Planning, we'll help you create a clear, personalized plan for cash flow even when you're not working. One that includes your 401k and all your other accounts. So you can make informed decisions that best fit your life ahead. Jesse's doing an awesome job with the information tonight. We should fix that though. Let's see. I like the colors. That white. Lightning's penalty kill has been six for six in the last two games. They're going to need it. In the next two minutes or so, Eric Chernak. Name White. I like that a little bit better. Going to get interference call. The shots yeah, they were fun. They Old school hockey play. games. Sasha Barkov kicks his feet out from underneath. Well, good luck to you there, Wine the Above Gaming. Good luck to you. Goes towards the Panthers way. Power play that started slowly. All right, power play. Puck getting dropped to the right of Tampa goal. 13.23 on the clock. Two-minute power play. Let's do it. Panthers sweaters look sharp and heavy. Got some good music going on in the background. I can deal with it. Out there right now on the power play. You don't see that very much anymore. Usually it's only one. O'Connell, what's up? Hey, you know, buddy? Good to see you. Here comes Tampa out the other way. Trying to go shorthanded a little bit. Set things up, and they do. And back into the corner. 
Brian Hart, Captain Duet flag. You got three Panthers in tight, so they spread it out. Sam Brian Hart gets it right back into the corner for Ekblad. Aaron Ekblad up top to Brandon Montour. Looking for a lane to shoot. Backs it on the inboard. Oh! By Kachuk ends up with Barkov. Down to Matthew Kachuk. On the attack here. Barkov. Six hundred career points, man. That's something. Vasilevsky's been the sharpest Tampa Bay Lightning. This is a really good save. Watch Vasilevsky try to look for the puck. He's able to see it. He has to look around his old guy, Cole. But he can see the angle of the shot. He's going to go to the far side. He shifts over just a tad, gets the blocker on it. His record, 59-1, and 9-16 save percentage. That save percentage has come a long way from the middle of November when it was down below 900. It takes a long time to get it back up. For Higgy with a shot, it goes high. As the Panthers change their personnel, they see four or five guys. Kachuk stays out there. And the lightning getting clear with half a minute to go. Half a minute to go on a power play. The power play, by the way, for Florida was after Hagel had gone all the way down the offensive end of the ice, passed it back to Looks like we're going to have a goal by Tachuk coming up. Here comes a goal by Matthew Tachuk coming up for Florida. I already saw it pop up on the board. At the end of the power play, looks like they're going to get it. Power play is over, but he tips it in. Matthew Chuchuk off the block. Wow. 3-1 Florida. Matthew Chuchuk with a three-point night. This one seemed to climb up the leg of Vasilevsky as well. Florida's a shooting team. Whether it's power play or five on five, he knocked that one right out of the air. Boy, that's eye-hand coordination all right. It went off of Bogosian's hand, which crippled him. Vasi couldn't see it at first because he's probably a little distracted by Bogosian. And in the puck is airborne. Next thing you know, Vasilevsky's trying to re react to it. Kachuk plunks it out of the air on top of Vasi's pad to roll it. Matthew Kachuk did not have any points. The last meeting at Emily Arena in December, and you and I talked about it, he was not very noticeable at all that night. Yeah. And he either was won by the Lightning 4-1. Well, he's a factor here tonight. Yeah, he is, he is rolling along, that's for sure. He leads the team in points, and he has been everything as advertised. He's he played the same way since he hit the National Hockey League. He's a real pain. He's, he's an in-your-face kind of guy. He's brash. He's bold. He's talkative. He's nasty. Yep. He's talented. He got the 60 points. The second fastest in franchise history. Only Pavel Burry did it faster. Burry was a great player. One away from 70. He's putting together a tremendous season here in South Florida. And the Lightning need Curtis family, hello. Well, thank you. I appreciate you, Curtis family. Hope things are going well with you guys. Just hanging out, doing a little bit of hockey. A little bit of Florida hockey. That's the big thing, Florida hockey. A word from Suncoast Credit Union. Do we really need a word from them? I guess we do. Well, I'll be covering those those hurricanes as we get into the playoffs. So there'll be a lot more of that coming, for sure. Cole 
Uh oh, we got another penalty coming. Another interference being called. Well, I hope they don't for you. I hope they play well. I hope they play well. Playoff hockey is a whole nother level, right? All right, here we go. Going under 10 minutes. Two minutes on the Tampa Bay power play. Going under 10 on the game clock. See if Tampa Bay can make something of this opportunity. All right, they're just getting it across the stripe. It's covered up by the goalie on the end around. They tried to go, Kucherov, Kucherov tried to go around the boards. That got cut off. Anybody new in here for the first time ever on our channel? Say hello in the chat. We'd love to say hello to you. Puck getting ready to get dropped to the right. Uh, Bobrowski. Uh, Bob I always get his name tough. Bobrowski. All right, Tampa's got it. Out on the wing, cross in the middle. Slap shot, no good. Tampa's still on the attack. Oh! Great deflection, but it went too high. 114 left on the power play. Man, you can hear it rattling around the pipes there. Kucherov is getting shots off. Under a minute to go in this bad advantage. Under a minute in the power play. Power play is going to get killed off, it looks like. Yeah, power play gets killed off. I'm seeing it on the other screen right now. Looks like we're going to get another penalty in just a second. Extended power play. There's a delayed call. Another two minutes on the power play. Uh, tough to ask your penalty kill to go on a almost a major. It's four or five minutes on the major. Ridiculous moves that no one can pull off in real life until now. Now there is that guy with the unfair 
his feet. The guy who scores just about every time in that one spot. And the guy who's basically a real life glitch. So were those games really that ridiculous? Or maybe they were just ahead of their time. Ahead of their time, I think those games were. Remember the days when the Pac-Man machine was it? Great job tonight on this, all this, Jesse. Thank you. You can save up to thirty percent when you add a hotel to your room, so you can have a bit more. Remember when it was Ms. Pac-Man? That was the hottest thing out there. Ms. Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, Cubert. Those days are long gone, but still. If Linda's thinking about retirement, they were good days. Get some help from Fidelity to envision what's possible. Fidelity can help her prioritize her goals by looking at her full financial picture. Plus, they'll help her pick an investment strategy, one she's comfortable with. And with a clear plan to get to retirement, Randy can enjoy wherever she's headed next. That's the planning effect from Fidelity. And Honda, we know you've got the drive to the bus. Yeah, they're not gonna budge. I need to get like a Pac-Man or a Donkey Kong machine. Donkey Kong would be the ideal. At some point, I want to do that. Even a mini tabletop one or something. Kalorn and he are gonna have a collision before they get to the pot. Kalorn pulls them down. The stick comes up and lets the Mundell stick hit Kalorn in the face, and that's where he got the penalty. And then at the end of the shift, they're barked off with a big shot clock. He was unhappy too because that one hurt. So another power play attempt. All right, Tampa back on the power play. One shot of their previous attempt. And this one is going to get sent all the way down the ice. Or Victor Hedman to retrieve and he gets it away to point. Nice. I'm sure there's places around here, but I haven't looked for them. And we're stalled up there, causing some disruption. And here comes Braden Point. Original Donkey Kong. It would be great. Or four or five games in a row. I'd like to have four of them in the basement. Joust, Donkey Kong, Hubert, Ms. Pac-Man. And maybe Popeye would be a good one. Kudrow. Working it now. Down to a minute left in the power play. Nothing there. Twenty-five seconds left. Looks like they're going to get a kill. Panthers doing a really good job tonight against Tampa on the power play. Oh, almost great save. Full strength. And we got a fight. Yeah, hit him. Hit him. Well, that's the save of the game so far. Great save. Hello, little puppy. Hi, puppy. That's a puppy. Hello, puppy. Hello. Yes. Sorry, that was Corey Perry. Archie, what are you doing behind me? Five hundred dollars. How big is that? Can't be full size. Proper. Come here. Come here. There's Copper. Oh. Oh. Where'd it go? I dropped it. Go to floor. Sorry. 
I dropped it. I don't know where it went. All right, Florida back on the attack. Here we go. Under six minutes at full strength. 3-1 game right now. Looks like we're going to get a timeout here in just a minute. Who is at my front door? Oh, hey. Oh, can't get it. There's your television timeout at 521 on the clock. I wish we could make this thing match up in time, but nothing I can do when the website's quicker. <laughs> Whenever you're watching like on Hulu or a streaming service, it's always behind. It's the last feed to go out from a, a live game. For each other and for their communities. <sighs> and at every level, from Pee Wee to the pros, Enterprise shows up for them. Proud to connect hockey fans to the game we all love. Want to grow your money but feeling kind of stuck? Get unstuck with Fidelity Go and automate your investing. Ready? Let's get on with these crazy commercials. If you're brand new in here for the first time, please say hello in the chat. We'd love to welcome you in. All fans are welcome here on this channel. Yeah, that's a small tabletop version. I think I've seen those before. Ways to double your winnings in over five hundred forty million dollars in cash prizes, plus thirty six new millionaires will be made. The Florida Lottery must be eighteen or older to play. Play responsibly. Now let's head down to the stand up one. Shirley. Cameroon attended the NHL. Oh yeah, I see. Well, they have one at Coles for five hundred bucks. Pac Man Legacy, fourteen in one game. At Coles of all places. That's actually pretty good. What other games are on it? Includes Ms. Pac-Man, Galaga, Dig Dug. Oh! Mappy, Dragon Buster, Rompers, King, and Balloon. Don't know what that is. Pac-Mania, Pac-Land, a bunch of other Pac ones. That's pretty cool that it's got uh, Dig Dug on it. All right, here we go. Back at it. Wow, and they'll ship it for free. That's Before something. That break, going to go back to something perfect. Stand. It was basically a three-on-one from the blue line in. As Sergeyev makes a play in the neutral zone, stops up. Look at Perfect as the lone guy back. He just does a heck of a job here. Really calm, but nice reach. He puts a stick on puck. Right as Lomberg wants to go way around him and on the back end, and just before he makes the pass, it's stolen off his stick by Perdick. The guy's got a lot of cool for a rookie defenseman in the NHL, I'll tell you. Certainly does. Never played any pro until this season. Stepped right into the NHL. Talked to him today, Brian. He said, I just came in with the attitude to play hard and simple. That's exactly what he does. He's just good at everything. He's efficient at everything. Hey, if you could do that at the NHL level and make it look like the NHL is no big deal, good for you. Here's the shot. All right, here we go. Back at it right now. 428 left in the end. Period. Oh! Over the crossbar. Panthers 
somehow he's got it and hangs on. Both chances at both ends of the ice. Anthony Sorrell yeah. had a chance first of all, but he's not able to penetrate. That's just something I'd like to do down the run. Scoring area. He comes in on the angle. Bobrovsky's got to shut up. There's no room in the middle. Then back comes Kachuk in Florida. Nice job here by Bogosia. He waits until the last second, then he lays down. That takes away any pass. So then Vasilevsky is able to read off of that. Okay, the pants can't get across. There's probably going to be a shot coming short side. It's got to be high, which is where it was. Vasilevsky good read. All right, here we go. 3.51 left in the second. Tampa trying to get at least make it a one-goal game going into the third. Oh, nice save, Florida. Wow. Stamkos is coming right at him, too. Just doesn't work out that way. Didn't show him much. Kicked that leg up very under control. Bobrovsky, most of the time, is not a very overly aggressive goaltender. He's tight and compact. Doesn't look spectacular. That's when he's at his best. Oh, another quick shot by Kudrov right off the draw. That one just missed up high. What a chance there. What a big goal that would have been for the Lightning. And now the puck comes. Free inside the blue line, knocked up ahead to Kudrov. Here comes Tampa Bay again. Nope, they're going to reset. Yeah. Hockey Boys, that's a cool channel name. What's up, Hockey Boy? That's pretty awesome. I like that channel name. Picked up an assist on that goal, sends it in. Let's dodge forward, way back to get it. Here comes Florida. Under three minutes. We got a goal for Florida. You can see it on your screen right there. We got a goal for Florida coming. Went down a little too far. We've got a Florida goal coming here in just a second. They've gone up four to one. I like it better when it's on my direct TV and the times are matched up. Hockey boys, this your first time here? Oh man, it went right through Vasilevsky's legs. Montour on the goal. Wow. Right through his legs. Florida's a shooting team, which means they know they're gonna four one. Cool. Well, welcome in. How do you like the way I do hockey? Wow. Thank you, Jesse. Let me see some fresh orange for ice cream. This smells good. Three goal lead with two minutes left in a period. Tampa Bay Lightning fans are sitting kind of quiet tonight. Kind of quiet tonight. Less than two in a period. Fix my shield. Said here, I'll get it. Thank you. Yep. They're going to be back 
All right, we're under, uh, we're one and a half left, one and a half basically left in the period. 4-1 game, Florida. It's tough to beat a team three times. And that's, you know, what Tampa Bay was trying to do. I love how they got the growling cat in the background. Growling panther. Under a minute, coming up on 20 seconds. It's getting quick. A lot of quick action here. All right, here we come up on intermission. Intermission coming up. We got the break there already on the board. We're just finishing it on the TV because they're a little bit behind us. Anybody have any questions for me as we're sitting here? Any questions about the game or the channel or anything we do? Throw them in the chat. Around the NHL, yeah. Vasilevsky's been a busy man in net. 34 shots on goal already for Florida. As advertised, they shoot from everywhere, and they have net run presence. Whether it's on the rush or they get in the zone to get it back from the point, those defensemen can shoot. Edmund snaps it in. Verhage, who got this thing started for the Panthers back in the first period. Um, all the way down in on Hockey boys, I don't really have a team. I mean, I, I cheer for Nashville a little bit just because I've been to more Nashville live hockey games than any other team. I just kind of like hockey. I like calling the games, you know. We're going to call a lot of hockey through these Stanley Cups and a lot of different teams and just have fun hanging out. How about you? Who's your favorite team? You have a favorite? I love the goal horn, too. There's somehow no better way to travel this place than on a plane. And when you add price drop protection, Expedia pays you back if your flight becomes cheaper. So you can taste your way to every single plate. Nice, Tampa Bay. Well, I call a bunch of Tampa Bay games because they're a good team. I try to call when I'm doing my games and I pick them. I try to pick two quality teams, so like I'm doing Tampa again on Saturday, I think. I think it's Saturday I'm doing them. Or playing Dallas, is it Saturday? I'm doing them again then. That'll be a good game. Tampa's had a good run for a couple years, right? They've done some good stuff. My daughter fixed Chinese this tonight for dinners. Pain in the ass to eat. Tastes good, but it's a pain in the butt. That's when Dr. Patchworth turned to his American Express business card, which offers spending potential that's built for his changing business needs. He used his card to furnish a new exam room, and everyone was happy. Get the card built for business by American Express. Can you hear? Yep. I got it with all the money I saved with Navy Federal Credit Union. This is a dumb commercial. I mean, can't imagine what I'd do without him. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Proud to share our support of the military with the NHL. Yeah. 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 
Navy Federal Credit Union. Our members are the mission. For the dudes, Very good. Changemakers, the moms, and dads, <coughs> for all those seeking a better future. Archie! Archie's hoping I'll drop something. What do you want? What do you want? You got a bone in your mouth. Are you supposed to have a bone? Are you supposed to have that? Got all the dogs running in here now. Sully just came in here and threw a bone at me. You better go. Go. It's going to take a lot for Tampa Bay to come back in this one. Down three. They can do it. I've seen them do it before. What are you looking for, buddy? You looking for something free to eat? Here, you want some rice? Eat some rice? Good boy. This is what I hate about the, when they, you know, use it on Hulu. You don't get a full broadcast. All right, let's see what's going on for a through 40 minutes of action tonight as the NHL resumes play following All-Star Weekend in South Florida. Dave Andrichuk, Paul Kennedy, the third meeting of the season between these two Atlantic Division rivals. In the first two, Florida scored a grand total of three goals. Mm -hmm. They have four in two periods tonight. What's been the difference? They're just hungrier, I think. You know, you look at uh, the way these, this game has gone. They seem to be on top of the puck. They're making the lightning, uh, turn some pucks over. Uh, they're winning the one-on-one -on -one battles. 21 shots in the period for the Florida Panthers. So, uh, as you said, Paul, three goals in that period. Uh, they were hungry for this win. Vazzy has already made 32 saves. Let's take you through our highlights in this game. Of course, one nothing after one. Tampa Bay will get a goal out of Nikita Kucherov, but Sam Bennett, four on four, Dave. It's two nothing Cats. Yeah, 147 in, just got left alone in front of the net. Just a little breakdown in defense there. That doesn't happen very much. There's Cole and Kucherov go to the man behind the net, and it's Bennett all alone. He gets his 13th of the year. He beats Vasilevsky. Rafi Kuchuk with another assist there. And then it's Nikita Kucherov. Good little one-timer here. Not, doesn't have to be hard. It's in the right spot. A little bit of a screen by a flyby by Ekblad. And Pervix and Bob Roski cannot pick it up as you see beats him to the blocker side there. That's Gooch's 20th of the year. He has a seven game point streak going now. Sergeyev at point. It's 3 1 quickly. Yeah, uh, on the power play here. It's just as it was ending. And you can see Kachuk the puck out of the air. That's Jack, Zach Bogosian. It hit the original shot, hit Bogosian in the hand. Good eye hand court. Florida has been relentless tonight. I called the last two game these two times, these two teams played, and Florida was not this aggressive as they've been tonight. Scored at one forty two. 840-1756. Kucherov scored a 302. In the second period, and it's 4 1 now through two in South Florida. I'd love to see Tampa make it a game here. Hockey League this evening, check out Bo Horvat and his debut for the New York Islanders. His new team is Tampa Bay and Florida renew their rivalry at the Cats in a big way. There's a still going through intermission, everybody. Still through intermission. The rainbow. The all new CRV and CRV hybrid. Part of the 
on the line. We're on this incredible tour of a troll themed Norwegian town, but we can get into a dumb argument. Our guide saves the day, whispering from behind the troll statue. Oh, right! You want me to see the view! One app over 300 Yeah, there are some really weird commercials on TV nowadays. For the Jews, really weird. The change makers, the moms, and dads, for all those seeking a better future. Walden University has been advancing remote learning for more than 50 years. With a degree from Walden, you can make an even greater difference. Kind of a quiet night here, you know? It's usually a little bit more. A little bit more activity in the chat. It's just a one of those uh, days. I thought everybody'd be pumped up with hockey coming back after the week off. You know. I use the every plate, and this cost me about the same as a cup of coffee. I'm gonna show you how. So every plate's actually twenty five percent cheaper than grocery shopping, which is awesome because that means I can save money on food even as food prices go up. And I love the fact that I don't have to worry about overbuying, wasting food, none of that. This is way better than takeout. I'm gonna get so much more bang for your buck. Seriously, you gotta try it. Get started for just $149 a meal using offer code EAT149. Better help make therapy accessible to all for a number of different reasons. <laughs> First a food commercial, now a mental health commercial. They're looking for someone who looks like them. I work with clients who are coping with anxiety, depression. Now a social worker. What's most important about working with these clients is really leaning in with a lot of curiosity. I became a therapist. The next commercial should be beer. We need a beer or alcohol commercial next. That would have us Americans down. Let's see if we get it. It's a commercial for... Shopping paradise with deals on every square. Shopping. You don't have to say this, do you? Uh, yeah. Deals aren't just for kids. They're stuff for you. You look great. So do you. And don't forget the house. The house is like a best friend in my present. What a house. Say big on friends we got. Zulu. Find part of the game. There's a lot of shopping commercials on this hockey stream. Kind of wild. It's a good Target commercial. It's got some good, good, good beats to it. That's totally Target. And now back to our little commercial break. Wait on ESPN to get back here. And by Mid Florida, Florida's community credit union. Matthew Kachuk dominating action tonight. Matthew Kachuk. And calling all hockey fans, the Tampa Bay Lightning will be hosting the Professional Women's Hockey Players Association for a six-game series, February 24th through 26th at the Advent Ladies Hockey, hockey coming up there into the Tampa Central soon. That's interesting. Players Association Look at that. The best hockey players that nightclub right there they're showing. The association Place is packed. Clinics and try hockey for free events throughout the weekend. That's wonderful. Visit lightninghockeydevelopment.com slash PWHTA for Professional Women's Hockey Players Association for tickets and sign up information. Do 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 do. We gotta be almost done this intermission. If we're not, Jesse's gonna start getting mad soon. In this game, uh, the NHL announcing its three stars day for the past week, which primarily focused on All Star Week, and no surprise, the number one star for the league is the number one star in this game. And so far, he's been dominant. Uh, you know, the, when the trade happens, it's a little bit of a shakeup. And everybody's wondering how the Florida Panthers will react and how Matthew Kachuk will play in South Florida while well, he's showing it tonight. Nice pass there. Where was Matthew Kachuk before this? Somebody give me a heads up. Where was he before Florida? Because I'm still learning all this hockey. They're talking about a trade. It must have happened recently. And if he was traded, why did they trade one of the best players in the game from wherever he went? He tries to bat it twice, actually, and he probably misses the second time. But it still goes in and beats Vasilevsky. Three points on the night so far. 
that line has been really good. But a few days, he said, he gets the automobile to bring the MVP, uh, his share of a million dollars uh, for the Atlantic Division, and uh, along with uh, Dylan Larkin and Mitch Marner, the three stars for the NHL, the past week, Marner had six assists in the round. Wow, round. six now, assists. Bill Horvat was skating for the Pacific Division, having spent nine years with the uh, Vancouver Canucks. But he was wearing the logo of the New York Islanders in doing so. Tonight, he marks his debut. He's not on the score sheet, but they are leading 2-1 um, on the New Jersey. Uh, make that uh, the Islanders leading right now as he skates in his first game uh, tonight, Dave, uh, in Philadelphia. Yeah, uh, Lou, Lou Lamorella pulls the trigger and makes the deal to get Bo Horvath. He's having a tremendous year. We talked about it the last time we played them. That's big for the Islanders. It's going to happen with him, and you think that he's now a New York Islander. And the reason Lou did this, as you can see where he sits in the standings, he's now two points out of a, a playoff spot, and there will be a little bit of a push by the New York Islanders. They've not played great in the last little while. They have won their last three games. But only the Panthers really need this. I mean, they're a couple points out so from being in the thing. The push that Lou wants to get the Sabres have played well as of the last couple of weeks. They were on a little bit of a... Bruins, Maple Leafs, Lightning have been on fire. Thompson's taken it over, and that's why now you look at where the Florida Panthers are sit. It's a big game for them. I think we're going to see if they can close out this third period. Certainly can. And in that Metro division here tonight, uh, New Jersey hosting Vancouver, Andre Palat gets a pair. The Devils trying to win and solidify uh, their position. The New York Rangers up 2-1 on Calgary. Uh, I thought the Panthers were having a better year than they were, to be honest with you. Uh, every goal important, every outing important from here on in, including this one for Tampa Bay. Not over yet, 30 or 20 minutes of hockey in store and just ahead. We're in Pantherland. Looks like we're getting ready to start the second or start the third. Coming up here. Yay! I'm completely good with that. Pantherland. It's an interesting name. I like it. It's different. Welcome to Pantherland. Maybe try switching your car insurance to Progressive. You could save hundreds. It's a great idea, TV Dad, but I said the exact same thing. Someday when you're a father, you'll understand. And his father <coughs> is not a competition. Listen to your TV Dad. Drivers who switch and save with Progressive will be seven hundred dollars on average. This is the Lexus variety of electrification, inspired by, created for, and powered by you. It's the first of the month. Time to pay rent. What a perfect day. Boost your Fiverr score with your rent. Look at all these different people are on. Those thanks to experience boost. What the heck is that? Well, now for the first time ever, paying rent can raise your FICO score instantly free with Experian. <laughs> now rent can boost your FICO score at Experian.com or get the app. Hey, Emma. You need a mattress, right? Yeah. I've been doing a little research. Uh, little? The Sofa Classic has two layers of springs that contour to the body. Nice. But... It has a three-inch Euro pillow top, Dan. All right. And... But I just want wow, to Marvel's got a live red carpet for Quantumania. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Darlings, are you ready to join my pillow party? Interesting. New pillow talk matte beauty blush ones, inspired by my sellout sensation. Easy liquid blush with beautifying pop of color. Universally flattering. Iconic. The Pillow Talk Party is back. Join the party and shop now at charlottetilbury.com. Better help make therapy accessible to all for a number of different reasons. Sometimes people are looking for that relatability. They're looking for someone who looks like them. I work with clients who are coping with... Toyota. Visit your local Toyota dealer.
All right, here we go. Third period. Get ready to kick in. Well, the Florida Panthers out here in South Florida in command after 40 minutes of play. A 4-1 over the Tampa Bay Lightning. Dave Brander back with you along with Brian Engbaum. So the Panthers, they were feeling pretty good about themselves after their last win against the Boston Bruins. Despite the long layoff, they've carried that into tonight, and they're being led by one line in particular. The Bennett line, Verhage and Kachuk on the wings, they have dominated. They've got 13 shots on goal, but more than that, they've got three goals and eight points total. In every aspect of the game, they're getting in on the forecheck, they're turning pucks over, and then they're making terrific plays. They're making Vasilevsky moves. They've had some good eye-hand coordination. There was a beautiful play from behind the net. And that mistake by the Lightning team, and they leave Bennett all alone, and he's very cool and calm. Hasn't lost anything during the, the break, the all-star break, and then that one was knocked out of the air. Eye-hand coordination by Kajak, who's one of the hottest players in the NHL right now, as of the all-star game, being the MVP of that one. And they have just dominated. The first goal was by Verhage on a beautiful cross-ice pass from Kachuk to Verhage and a great shot over Vassie's glove. So Lightning have to find an answer for these guys. You see over there the Florida... All right, here we go. Now, Back at it live. Blocked a shot with about eight minutes to go in the second period. Tampa needs to find something six. quickly here. In the first oh, couple minutes, here. get one on the board, cut the lead in half. Here. Panthers look really confident tonight. San Jose tomorrow night. So this is sort of like a four-period game. they got to build something for tomorrow, too. If they get back in this game on the scoreboard, great. But they've got to start playing better than they have in the first two periods, no doubt, and have that lead into the game tomorrow. This one will take care of itself. <coughs> Make one little move, but roll away from him. It goes in towards the net. Bounced out in front, and it's picked up by Ekblad. Oliver Hagee can't control that puck, and it's sent back down by the Lightning. Good start to this third period. Out of zone time here. Come on, cutting in. Oh! Trying to walk out, and he couldn't get around that sick check of Bobrovsky. We've got a Florida Panthers goal coming up here in just a second. I already see it up on the board there. They're getting ready to put this game out of reach. Good puck movement, good positioning, all that's important for sure for the Lightning. Eric Stahl is going to be on the shot here in just a minute. Florida just showed they want it more. Their battle level is higher. Point with a shot. It is blocked. And it's banged up by the Panthers. Well, he came in having lost the last two in a regular season, and, and that's really six in a row if you want to go back to the playoffs because we all remember that sweep in the second round. Oh, my God. What a bad pass by Tampa Bay there. Yeah, Tampa Bay came out hot here. What happens? Oh my God! Vasilevsky went out wide to get a puck and had it taken away from him in an empty net. Unbelievable. Yeah, it's turned into one of those nights for the Lightning now. Vasilevsky has made a lot of good saves in this game, and the goals that have gone in haven't exactly been his fault, but this one definitely is his fault. Eric Stahl just takes a flyer on, okay, I'm going to go behind the net and see if he makes this play correctly. And Vasilevsky missed his spot on the wall. He knows where he's supposed to hit it off of. Wow. In order to get it behind the net and off the angle. And off That's the other just not side. something you see that often. That's a freebie for Eric Stahl. That was Eric a freebie. Stahl with his eighth goal of the season. He didn't even play in the NHL last year. He played for Team Canada at the Olympics. And here a professional. 
intellectual tryouts on a one-year deal. He's 38 years of age, and that's a tough one to give up. <coughs> and we're trying to claw back into this one, and they still are stepping in the it's gotta take, Now it's going to take it is an overwhelming amount to a four-goal lead. You ain't kidding. When you're 38, you got to work. Play hockey, a physical game like that? Under 16 on the clock. Under 16. Approaching 15. We got another one getting ready to go on the board for Florida. They just put another one in. Good gravy. When this clock catches up here in about 30 seconds. Holy heck fire. Florida came out possessed. Possessed. Colorado comes in. Bad taste in the mouth from having played them in the finals last year and then off on the road. That'll be a nationally televised game at Dallas. The face off will take place at center ice after the puck went up and out of play. And the Lightning control it. Five minutes gone in a third period that's going to feel pretty long here for the Lightning. Down by four against the Florida Panthers. Goes up and over the outstretched arm of point. Here's Kachuk, and it's again the Boom! Wow. Good Lord. Vasilevsky having a rough night. Six to one. Wow. Second four-point game of the season for Matthew Kachuk. 
in this his 23rd multi-point game. And how about Carter Verhagen now with 28 goals on the season? That is a new career high for him and building with lots of games left. Nine goals in his last nine games. And this is all Panthers tonight, folks. Panther fans in attendance are letting them hear it. Belmar. Down the ice, in the corner, cycles it back just out of the reach there. Mesnikov. Kogosian puts it back around, waiting for it to Perry. Perry trying to skate it away from Gudis to the line. The quick shot and the save made by Bobrovsky. He will hang on. We will take a break. The Florida Panthers have added two more. In the opening stages here of this third period, one of them by Eric Stahl, and then this one by Carter Verhege is second of the night. This is crazy. I wasn't expecting a 6-1 game. I'm James Brochet with the Baltimore Ravens. I know that having the right team on your side makes all the difference. If you or someone you love is struggling with mental health, or problems with drugs or alcohol, there's a team in Maryland who can help. To talk with a caring call specialist, call or text 988 to connect with the National Suicide and Crisis Lifeline. Asking for help is always the right call. That Big Quest Nutrition is now better, softer, yummier. Big news. Very big news. It's way bigger than a protein bar. It's a quest. One teaspoon of potassium iodide. Check a room. And then science. Oh, okay. Let's go. Right, let's go. Let's go. Just a little bit. Oh, let's do more. Do more. Yeah, I can. I can do more. All in. Uh, yes, please. Super easy. Man, I just bought a car from Carvana. A lot can happen in a moment. <laughs> They're delivering it here. Like That's kind of funny. Like finding the perfect mix of down and monthly payments. It's great. Finance your next car with Carvana today. If you're thinking about going back to school, this is for you. I ended up spending less money my entire time at SNHU than I did in just one year at my other university. My time at SNHU. Oh, come on already. See, they're already back at it on our screens. I wish it was all timed up. Are they taking Vasilevsky out? <laughs> yeah, they are. Off, maybe cetera, not. Et and the way this one has gone, it may be for, you know, get Vassy out of there and not... They should. They should get Vasilevsky out. You're down 6-1. Under 12 on the clock. Dick Cousins works the puck down the ice, takes a hit, rolls up. Most of it from Bogosian. And now back, Bogosian takes the puck behind his own net. Inside the Florida blue line, held in by Colton, sends it back down, hard off the glass. Now Marone out in front, and it kind of hands up Nick Paul there, was in too tight. Back out the center, knocked down by Eric Stoll. This will be the fourth time that the Lightning have surrendered six goals against this season. Their season high against is seven. Back in December against the Detroit Red Wings. Bogosian around the boards to Kalorn. And Kalorn works into open ice. Anton Lundell was, was in there. And the lady get it out. Going under 12 minutes. Coming under 12 minutes. Two teams will meet one more time this month at Amelie Arena on February 28th. Oh, that one went off the referee hard. Ouch. the upper body area. Here's the bell right. Here's a centering pass. Picked up by Vasilevsky and cleared by Stamkos. And that was Look at their shots on goal. 40 to 28. Not centering that line. Luke Brennan was out there with him. We haven't seen Barkov come back out onto the ice. And yeah, no, we mentioned that. He was uh, yeah. He blocked that shot then. Looks yeah. like he is definitely done for the night. And he's, as you mentioned earlier, Brian, he... He's missed a few games here. He's been injured. He had pneumonia earlier this season, and they yeah. struggled without him. 
He is the one guy they cannot play without. Markoff had missed 10 games already. The Lightning, uh, excuse me, Florida only won two of those games in regulation. They ended up with four points out of, uh, excuse me, six points out of a possible 20 points when Barkoff was out of the lineup. That's how indispensable he's been in the type of player that he is. Here's Brian Elliott. Looks like he's gone through his stretching, so they must have given him some kind of word, and we just wait to see how this is going to all go down. But, I mean, we're confident we're going to see him tomorrow in that game at home against San Jose. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. No doubt about that. Andre Vasilevsky has made six consecutive starts for the Lightning, including tonight. He's been playing a lot. Nice takeaway. Coming the other way. He will reset, no doubt, for the reigning Stanley Cup champions, the Colorado Avalanche, Thursday night at home at Emily Arena. Stoll puts this one off the boards and down the ice, and it's going to be picked up by Cole. Cole puts up there by Smith to the line and back out to center. Now, Chernak also blocked the shot, and he wasn't feeling too good. I don't think we've seen a shift from him yet here in this third period. It's been a long night for him. Things have not gone well. Trinac with a minus four after two periods. He and Cole were split up, but I haven't seen Trinac out there with Cole here in the third period. This one up the center right. It's knocked down by a high stick. With the going under Trinac 10 minutes. Under 10. Point. Takes the check there from Eklat after he got the puck deep. Quick Man, Florida is just twice as aggressive as I've seen them the last time they played. They're getting a stick everywhere they need to. Loose pucks falling where they need to tonight. Boy, he made some nice moves at the blue line. His lateral movement along the offensive blue line is as good as anybody in the league. And he got that pass across to Kucherov. He didn't quite get all of it. But then as the shift went on, he was involved again. So Sergey certainly showing good signs here in this game. Quick backhander kicked out there by Bobrovsky. And it's out. Back down the other way. And that rebound went right out to Pat Marillo. But it went right over his blade. He had the empty side of the net. But the puck was airborne. Here is Chernak. To answer your question, Brian, yep, he is up there. Maroon in tight, got it. Little backhander away. Bobrovsky kicked that out as well. Maroon probably had as many looks as anybody on the Lightning tonight. And Cole spins off that check. You know what's been driving Maroon's game of play is his physicality. He's got 14 hits in his last three games. Yeah. And when he's in games like that, he's a factor. Yeah, but it's the offensive zone. It's in the corners and the back of the net, and turning pucks over and then grinding to the front of the net. That's the way Pat Maroon plays, so contact is his game for sure. It's a hard way to play. It takes a lot of energy to do that, but when he's on his game, that's it. Graham goes up the ice. He's got Cologne with him, and he fired it wide. A great chance on a two-on-one. Cologne and Stankos, and now Stankos in behind the play is having words with the Montour. Yeah, Montour. And they are still thinking about it at center ice. They're skating around. Throw the fist! Hit somebody! Samber hasn't let off. Nope, he wants Montour to go, and Montour is not going to... Stamkos, and they're just standing on... They're dancing like it's prom night. Hit somebody! That's done. You're not talking to him anymore. Stamkos was really upset. And it's, it's one of those games. I mean, nothing is going right for the Lightning at this point. So with 8.38 to go in the third period, we will step aside. The Florida Panthers in charge tonight, 6-1. What's he doing? He's cleaning the trash cans. Wow, 6-1 game. I never thought when I got into this one tonight, that's the score I'd be looking at. I can try. Hey, what you doing? Ah, just cleaning the trash can. It's important to build trust. See so if we put your address and phone number on here. Well, you can never be too safe. With trash? Progressive can't protect you from becoming your parents, but we can protect your home and auto when you bundle with us. Don't look at the head, you're going to mess. Always looking at the head. 
this electric feels different. Because it's powered by the most potent source of energy there is. You. This is the Lexus variety of electrification. We come back here under 10, under 10 remaining. Thank you guys for being in here tonight. Thank you to Jesse and a couple other people that were in here helping me get this new wave done. Lyle, I appreciate you trying to get the new setup done a little bit more open, a little bit more visible for you uh, in the on stream. Trying to make it as fan friendly as we can. What's up, JD? Let me send. I wonder. I wonder if Jeff will answer my text. During the TV timeout, he was incensed with Montour. Go back and show you what happened. Careful, you're sitting next to a serial killer. He got tweaked up and had the legs pulled out from underneath him. The immediate slash of the cross check. And Montour with a few words for him as they go back into the neutral. See if zone. Jeff will answer. Whatever he said, that just added fuel to the fire, and Stammer never stopped after that. He's still at Epcot. I don't. Neither one has gone to the penalty box. Yet. Well, thanks, JD. So the referees have given I always appreciate. It. I don't. I was just, you know, watching them, monitoring them while I was doing this to help them. Sorelli make sure the Lombard's not going to do anything to the captain. Everything. I keep quiet a lot when I'm in chats. We haven't seen, you know, I've got six streams on right now, J.D., around my studio for everybody that's live. Some of it certainly is the score and Lightning are just totally frustrated at this point. But we've, we've seen so many explosive uh, situations between these two teams. Jeff's still at Epcot. He's, He's sitting next to Jersey Mike. Always a few, few comical words of nothing else from the bench. He's got that little smirk on his face. You know, he just said something to somebody in a red jersey. Watch this. Yeah, penalty boxes are I'll tell Mike. So, so far, where's Mike? So good in that respect. This cross state rivalry. Tell really Jeff to look at his phone. Level when they met in the playoffs a couple of years ago, the very the first ever time they met in the See if anything having fun with that. Oh, they're at the they're at uh. The NHL said was one of the better. Uh, they're at Chicken Guys is where they're at. It was physical. It was high scoring. It was close. It was intense all throughout the six games before the Lightning. Finally put him away, and then last year was kind of a surprise. Everybody was, you know, all set for another round two, and it was a quick sweep. Yeah, exactly. The Panthers scored just three goals in the four games, and this was one of the highest scoring teams. All right, here we go, back at it. And the Lightning just had their way and put a quick end to that. And they started this season with back-to-back -back wins, and Panthers were ready for them tonight. Lock Panthers are definitely back. ready for them tonight. Panthers came ready to play tonight. Television time out. With eight minutes to go, I guess unless you know something more drastic happens. I mean, he battled and he continues to battle here. Florida has everything working for them. They're in the right spot. The pucks are going to them, and the Lightning are down by five. They know they got to play tomorrow night, but still, you can't hang your. Lightning got a bunch of games this week. He's certainly battling to the end. There was a chance for Brian Lomberg and the slide on the back end. Tell you, there's no announcement here, but we are now being told that matching 10 minute misconducts were handed out to Anthony Sorelli and Montour. So they're both done for the night. Eight minutes to go here in regulation. It would have been a long night in sunrise for the Bolts. And they return after the long layoff. Going under eight minutes. Under eight. Shot saved by Vasilevsky in that glass from Ekblad. Panthers, back up the Panthers just came ready to play tonight. Florida came out like they were one of the top teams going to beat on somebody. Crowd's a mixed crowd, too. There's a lot of blue and white in the, in the stands. Makes sense. I mean, it's so close to Tampa. And the Lightning just looking to clear it, and they do. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointed in them, J.D. I thought they'd be better. Yeah, 
Josh Barrera's had quite a bit of ice time. He, he's come along a long ways. They got him on waiver wire, and he played with Ratko Gudis, and they played, formed the third pair. And they brought a lot of stability to that third pair. You're going to go under Gudis six minutes. Under six. Yeah. Got the one guy banging on the window behind the behind the pipes. I'd love to see just one of the players start banging back at him. I always want to see that. Never happens. Oh, we're gonna have a late penalty here. Gonna get a power play, everybody. Always good to have a power play from time to time. It's one of those nights, folks. I, there's no other way to say it. Watch this. He's going to turn around. He thinks the puck is coming to him. You got in trouble at Kane's game for banging on the glass, did you really? You always just want, like, the refs or somebody just bang it right back at them real quick. That would always be fun to me. This is what they do. The Florida Panthers are, they have the most shots on goal in the league. They've hit 50 numerous times this season. And they're in all likelihood going to do that again tonight. This is their second power play. Genie, hello. Shots for the man advantage. And Clyde, to Bennett. Sam Bennett has got a couple of points. Cross that speed. And they slide that shot. Goes high. Off the stick of Verhege. He was looking for the hat trick tonight. Oh, yeah. He was actually in a better spot there. Than he was the two goals that he scored. I mean, he was able to drift right into the prime scoring area here. A big seam open. Yeah, he's dead center. Did uh, Cole maybe get a piece of that? I'm not quite sure. It seems to get deflected a little bit. I think, oh, Bassey. I think Bassey got a piece of that one. Yeah. Oh, he didn't miss the net. Off the draw. Back to the line. Oh my God! Here we go. Power play goal. About ready to drop in. Panthers all over Tampa like white on rice tonight. Good Lord. Bennett's off the mark. Bennett's got it again. Quick tip in. Boom. There it is. Five points tonight for him. That's up. Wow. Five points on the board for him tonight. All right, we're, we're under five minutes left. <laughs> I'm going to call it a night. This game is well over. We'll check back on Tampa Bay this weekend. Hopefully, I'll see a better performance. Thank you, members. Thank you, moderators. Well, we don't have any members. You're still members to me. I don't care if you're a member or not. you are still always be a member. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Jesse, moderators, everybody that was here having a good time. This game has gotten ugly. Good gravy. We, I'm going to go get some Pepto-Bismol and see if Gonzo still smells like a, you know, Baramese monkey when I talk to him. We'll see you sometime real soon, everybody. Good night, and thank you for watching.